Hi there, here is Sophie Marcel, and today we will test our new profile 094 Gordon Gapless. So, this is a very modern solution because after installation of stretch ceiling, you will not have uh, any masking elements such like um, uh, PVC masking tapes or, for example, plastic decorated elements. Uh, <clears throat> the main thing is that we uh, remove all the mistakes from our previous models. And the first one, this profile will be a little bit deeply because we want uh, to hide uh, all the it's all hangers uh, for our cordons and also we make this profile a little bit widely uh, for the comfortable moving of your cordons it's not easy profile for installation but the final result will uh, look very aesthetically you can launch this prof uh, that profile with the wall mounted profile or for example you can finish it uh, on the ceiling using front and caps. Uh, you have the first element that you need to fix with the using screws for the construction of the profile, for the end of profile, and then after installation of stretch ceiling you need to stick your film uh, in this shape of profile. And then you need to decorate your corner. So you use the second uh, element pre-finished in black or white uh, it based on which color of color, uh, which color of profile you <coughs> choose for for your realization profile. The first thing is that you need a special mounting tool, the goose type spatula. It's very hard to install, as you can see, uh, and the principle of installation looks like a multi-level stretch ceiling. Also, you can place here LED strips, but we have one uh, main recommendation, please do it after installation of stretch ceiling because uh, you can damage LED strip using spatula or for example uh, with a hair. So I recommend to do it this way. You need to make measurements of your LED strip, the length of uh, LED strip, uh, then launch it with uh, electricity and uh, stick it to the construction of profile using duct tapes or any any different ways, uh, like you want. Uh, and then after the installation of the ceiling, you need to paste it uh, concretely in that place, and the result will amaze you. Uh, so guys, if you want to mount uh, our curtain uh, 09 for gapless close to the wall, uh, you need uh, to work the same way like, you, like when you realize mud level stretch ceilings. So we make a 45 degrees cut in wall mounted profiles. In our situation this uh, 0112 profile, the shadow profile. And uh, the main thing that you need to know if you want your curtain to look nice, you need to make a little pre-cut here uh, on the thickness of uh, wall mounted profile. But this part of this profile not need to be cut it is the main thing. So. So, we are starting to glue our harpoon to the ceiling. So, the main thing you need to know is that we need to remove all the dust, all the dirty from the harpoon and from the ceiling. I use uh, Dinatural isopropanol, so you can use any kind of solvent. And the one thing that you need to remember is that you need to start uh, gluing from the, uh, 30, from the 3 centimeters from the uh, shape of profile inside to the profile. So why we do this way? Because we don't need to um, stretch it with a, a big reduction. Uh, it needs to be easy. And the second main thing that you need to know, uh, you need to hit it well. If you will not do this, you will not have any success. So here is the result of our job. It's look pretty nice. Uh, 
So if you might also wish you to have a good projects, good realization, good plans, uh, subscribe to our official channel. See you later.